Hey, how's it going everybody? It's LC Bradley 3 k and we are checking out the Unreal Engine 4 tech demo. So there's a lot of, there's a few parts of this, I think five different demos. This is just a realistic rendering of a room, and it just looks fantastic. I don't even want to say much, you can't really describe it with words, but... Uh, I remember I tried out CryTech's uh, CryEngine 3 during its tech demo, but this just is a whole entire new level of indoors especially. So I'll just do a quicker walk around of this, and then we'll move on to the next one, because this one's actually pretty simple overall. Uh, but you can check out my setup in the description, too, if you want to see what this is running on. But I'm getting, like, 60 frames, so... Although YouTube makes it 30, but you get, you get the point. Great backdrop, great lighting. And, uh, yeah, that is the realistic rendering. So we'll move on to the next one, which is a little bit more complicated. Alright, so this is their example of a shooting game. So match starts in 8 seconds, and you'll be able to see that. But overall, the lighting, once again, is just incredible. This is more of an outdoor type. And there actually is enemies. I tried this one out. This is the second one I tried out. Oh, shit. Oh, that was quick. Yeah, just imagine, like, every imagine better textures and everything, and this would be incredible shit. <laughs> Alright, this is... Okay, that was a little embarrassing, but you get the point. We'll spawn in again, see if we can find any enemies this time. We're not at a good spot. Bot 2. But yeah, just imagine this world filled with better textures, and with the lighting, it would just be substantially amazing. I don't think that's a word, but we'll walk over to the porch over here. Just absolutely incredible. Any more enemies? This is a pretty good spot. I hope we got some down there. Alright, well I don't want to hold you up too much with this one. So let's move on to the next one. Next up is a cave demo. I actually have not tried this one yet, so... I guess I'll be exploring on my own for the first time. But as you can see, like the there's literally endless possibilities with this engine. You can design so much, so many different environments. Even the water looks great, the fire. You can see the contrast there with the light. We'll walk out here, see what we got. I don't really know how to kneel, I don't think you can. It's just general moving. Hence the tech demo. I can jump though. Yeah, I think that's really it for the cave demo, but yeah, you can see the light up there, the water, and the fire. I mean, just just look at the particle effects. Everything is just... I'm nerding out here, but everything is just incredible. Lighting coming down from here, shining down on the leaves. There's so many different games that could be made from this engine. Alright, water, can I fall down in here? What happens? And I'm stuck. <laughs> Alright, well now I'm stuck, but you get the point, and we'll move on to the next one. Alright, this next one is called Temple Mobile, and I just tried this out a second ago. You guys are going to be blown away by this view you're about to see. This is literally incredible. And you saw the way the light changed too when we walked in, but... I mean, come on, you can't beat that. That's a picture, obviously, but... Just everything. The lighting, it's perfect. I'm just going to nerd out this whole entire time. But yeah, when you walk in and walk out, you can just see the difference, and it's amazing. Let me see if I can go this way. I think all these areas are pretty small, though, for the most part, just to get the feel for it. Alright, so this is like a dark area with fire. Very cool, very different. And just realistic fire, too. That's pretty cool. You don't always see realistic fire in games anymore. Ash pit. Alright, and that is it for this one, and there's one more after this. And this last one is just a rendering that I can't really move in at all, but this is to show off the reflections of the game. So obviously, dim lighting with puddles. I think it can actually move eventually, but... Yep. Not much to say after this, it's just amazing. It kind of looks like an awesome version of Battlefield 4, if you think about it. And I think I can move now, but... Oh, no, I can't. Not yet. 
I remember trying this once, and I was all confused because it, it opens up to... It, this one's just a weird demo for some reason. It's like 32, but not 64. But yeah, so... I move? Alright, now I can move. <laughs> um, I'm using all my three monitors because it wouldn't let me set the dimensions, so I'm gonna have to crop this out, so that's why I'm getting terrible FPS. But yeah, that is that. And um, that's all of them. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed this little demos, few demos, and uh, subscribe for more content. Have a good day.